Okay, so it goes without saying I cannot pronounce this race. But I can tell you it's three mile one furlong and it's a grade one and it's a hurdle and it's according to the boss up the top for Darren Howes and so too Dunawan All, Napoleon Grey, Pop Pickers, Shipstone Bluff, Wizardor, Your World Within, Bene Sinatra, Geezer Bird, Gummer Valley, the favourite seven to four, Paper Promise for Ghost Apper Stables, Potter's Midnight and Rutherglen for David Robinson. Racing. There's no real pace, but pushing through there is Potter's Midnight. And that's opened up a handy lead. And there's a couple of horses, or a few horses out here. Caught very wide on the track. Both of Moliettes are wide as they go over the first to 15. And out there, uh, David Robinson sourced Rutherglen and Stu's Napoleon Grey as well. And done one all out the tail. I reckon they might have been out the tail for a long way last week. Still completed the course. You'll be glad to know I'm finishing off the Chardonnay tonight and it's still tasting great as they go over the third flight slow jump there from Shipstone Bluff but probably not a bad thing as it'll get a little closer to the rail when they take this left hander than what it would have if it jumped it uh, good or because it would have been stuck outside Stu's horse and it's now inside of it or that hooked around it so Potter's Midnight leads clearly from Geezer Bird. Paper Promise. Wizardor down on the fence having a nice run. And they're starting to spread out here and the horse is getting closer to the rail. Rather than Napoleon Grey, looks like the only grey in the race. Uh, Gummer Valley. Shipstone Bluff, Ben Sinatra, the stable mates, out on the outside of Pop Pickers. Your World Within, just sitting wide on the track, getting a good cider. Down along the back straight here, then we've got According to the Boss and Dunno and All. And up and over they go. So you're the world found us way back down to the fence. As they go over the seventh. And the second last day of the SO6 League. So to say, it's been a big success <coughs> compared to leagues in the past. As they run down the home stretch here and past the winning post, there'll be a lap to go. Caught wide Napoleon Grey. So to uh, it would be Shipstone Bluff and Gray's Horse there, Pop Pickers. Now Napoleon Gray crosses down to the fence.
It's safe to say SO6 League has been successful. Not perfect, but definitely successful. Probably a few things that just can't be fixed. And maybe one or two things that can be sharpened up. So Dunno and All has been pulled up. Potter's Midnight is really pushing the pace and according to the boss has been pulled up as well so bad luck Darren Howells there both your horses now are out of the race and Gummer Valley moves up and takes a lead now from Potter's Midnight and Josh's two horses Wizardor and Your World Within have moved up and also there is Ben Sinatra and they've broken away from Geezer Bird and Paper Promise. Napoleon uh, Pop Pickers, Napoleon Grey, Rother Glen and Shipstern Bluff. So they run on down towards the furlong and Wizardor gets up on the outside of Gummer Valley, but Gummer Valley fights back and is actually pulling away, goes over the last, jumps as good as the any any of the four up front here. And this looks like a win for Gummer Valley as it cruises on down to the line. And Gummer Valley wins from Wizardor, Your World Within third, Potter's Midnight fourth. So not a big gap between first and last here. And that's a handy win for Gummador. Darren Thompson, congratulations. Wizardor second for Joshua Sutherland. World Within was also Josh's horse. Fourth, Potter's Midnight for Ghost Zappa. And fifth was Geezer Bird for Paul Rhodes.